Good evening once again. There's a parent group concerned with equal conditions at the Buffalo School District. The group says that some teachers won't even send their own children to schools in the city of Buffalo. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Justin Moore found out how this group says it is trying to help fix the problem now. Something needs to be done, and I petition that the district immediately does something. A group of parents say they are fed up with the latch institutional racism they say is going on at Buffalo Public Schools. Now they are pushing for an investigation by the Department of Justice. We're asking for the Office of Civil Rights to come in and to take a closer look at the issues of suspension, take a closer look of where racism is not being confronted in our school system. The group says the biggest issue is the disproportionate number of students of color being accepted into the district's top three schools like City Honors compared to the high number of white students who are accepted. We structurally ensure white children get a top quality education, um, but we structurally have not made the adjustments to ensure that everybody else benefits. And that Sam Rafford with the Buffalo right Parent right Coordinating right Council right says right the racial right bias right. extends beyond acceptance at the criteria schools. 91% of our school teachers are white, mm -hmm. and they don't send their children primarily yeah. to the schools in our community. And these issues have BPS leaders concerned. We're all concerned about implicit bias, about, you know, the type of racism that is sometimes unknown and unspoken. Um, I know that our superintendent is extremely committed to making sure that we have a culturally responsive school district. And I'm, I'm hopeful that Dr. Cash and the school board um, will continue to partner um, with us as we be, look to address these issues. Because I won't stop advocating. I won't stop fighting until something is done. Justin Moore, 7 Eyewitness News.